Hello everybody. Today we released our 2023 Housing Barometer Outlook where we examined over 13 markets across Canada measuring the average loan to value ratio. What is loan to value? Well, it's, it's the amount of loan somebody takes versus the amount of equity in their home. So in layman's terms, if you have a million dollar home and you only have a $500,000 mortgage on it, you've got a 50% loan to value ratio. So the lower the lower loan to value ratio, the more equity you have in the home and the, the greater ability you have to weather any uh, potential or existing downturn in the marketplace. So why did we do this? Well, there is a tremendous amount of negativity in the press. Uh, the sky is falling everywhere you look and everywhere you watch. And as you can tell by this report, which you can get on blog.remax.ca, that is very far from the truth. Yes, there are a lot of people that bought in 2021 and early 2022 whose homes aren't worth what they were when they originally purchased them. But through our research, you can see that the bank of mom and dad has transitioned a tremendous amount of wealth to the next generation, which has allowed people to build equity in their homes. Also, the majority of people who bought pre-2021 are in a stronger equity position than they began. And interest rates were incredibly low for an incredibly long time. And so during that span, people were paying down huge chunks of their mortgages month after month after month. And so, you know, the narrative around incomes haven't kept pace with housing values um, is just a stretch in a lot of ways. Obviously, I mentioned there are exceptions, but if you look at the data and the details in this report, you will see that overall the Canadian housing market is able to withstand uh, some great shocks. So thanks for watching. Again, you can get the report on blog.remax.ca and I hope you enjoy. Bye.